Do you know for individuals that might not be in church leadership or a role where where they're in that environment? Because when I was in real estate, man, it was very much a you know, there's a saying that your business grows to the extent that you do. And so there's mm. a huge emphasis on personal growth and development. And I thank God that I chose this career uh, or it was kind of thrusted upon me because of that. Mm. And then because of that, it, it has helped me in so many other areas. But for people who, you know, don't get that out of a company or out of a church, I'm just trying to think, man, what are some places and some ways that someone can grow in that? What are your thoughts? Yeah, I I think first and foremost, podcasts like this, um, you have to expose yourself to different ways of thinking. You have to expose yourself to different books. Um, I mean, there is a like one of my favorite things to say is is books, podcasts. And YouTube are like the cheat code of life today. Like, if there is anything that you want to learn, you don't have to go buy a manual. There's been so many things that I have thought, hmm, I got to put this thing together. I mean, we, you know, our little girls won. There's a lot of stuff that had to be put together in preparation for that. I'd get the instructions and I'd be like, somebody's got to have made a YouTube video on how to do this. And I just watch people do it. And so books, podcasts, YouTube, like to say that we don't know how to do something is to say that we don't want to know how to do it bad enough to go find the answer. Mm -hmm. Um, I think Facebook groups um, have been huge for me to connect with people that are doing what I'm doing steps ahead of me. Uh, I think being able to, if you're like, okay, I want to learn this thing, type it into a search bar and see what happens. Like you're going to get a lot of information that is probably way too much, not enough, really good and really bad, but you have to get started. And so it's, okay, I have this thought. I want to learn how to fill in the blank. Okay, how to do the thing you want to do. And so it's, I think sometimes people, and myself included, we overcomplicate the starting process when really we could go to our local bookstore or, you know, the podcast app on your phone or YouTube and find out that somebody has probably done what we're wanting to do. 